the, the back end processing was, is a big, big, big component of uh, franchise profitability. Throughout the, 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 the sale with the customer, um, you're collecting material, you're collecting things, computers and laptops and tablets and phones and printers and monitors and all the stuff, the electronics that a, that a customer has. And a franchisee is going to take all that stuff and they're going to ship it to us and we're going to process it for them. Um, and one of the reasons we did that was because it makes things simpler. It makes it much more simpler for the franchisee and it, and it builds on the idea that all that material being processed in one place creates a, a really great economy of scale. In some cases, a large percentage of revenue uh, in a given period can, can uh, for the franchisee, can be coming from the back-end processing. Um, and it's, you know, it's, the nice thing about back-end processing is that there's no receivable, so we try, to, we try to get that money back in the hands of a franchisee as fast as we possibly can. At the same time, we treat every computer like FedEx treats every package. Um, we want a franchisee to be able to have full accountability or full disclosure on every single item that we take from them. So an example would be franchisee gives us 20 computers that they picked up from one of, the, from, from one of their customers. Um, we want them to be able to log into the system and, and, and understand what happened in terms of value to that computer. If it went and was scrapped, why was it scrapped? Because there's a big difference between scrap and resale. If an item gets refurbished and resold, it's worth significantly more than if it's torn down for parts and pieces. So, you know, we, we feel it's just a simple thing that, you know, trust comes with visibility. You know, when, when you have good visibility and you can understand things, you build trust.